Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is iTalk. Here, and in today's video, we have a brand new video. Fort Nightmares is lasting a month long. Now, believe it or not, I was talking to a friend of mine named Sharktooth, who you may know as making some awesome concept skins in Fortnite. We talked about how we wish that Fort Nightmares lasted a bit longer than two weeks, because if you guys remember, Fort Nightmares for every year has only lasted really two weeks. Well, we got our wish because this Fort Nightmares is lasting all month, and I could not be more excited about it. So we have three news posts to go over with you guys so let's just go through them really fast and let's just see what exactly we're getting in this fort nightmares first thing to let us know is that remember in the trailer we had those dual wield crossbows they are in the game right now they say so you've been venturing into the sideways to get some sideways weapons like the fiend hunter crossbow the dual fiend hunters deal extra damage to cube monsters but being more modern the hunters have a faster fire rate than the crossbow predecessor so it just means it shoots faster where to find them the dual fiend hunters can be found in chests or on the ground take them with you into the sideways to help you turn the tide your way and at the very bottom they say the dual fiend hunters are not included in competitive playlists so this is available now which is pretty sweet like i said we still have two more of these news posts to go over so next one is fort nightmares 2021 foretells iconic creatures cubic chaos and screen time scares they say your fortune foretells a lot in this year's fort nightmares in fact things are all in the cards for you all the way till november 1st so basically an entire month which is really awesome i'm really happy about that they say the first thing in the cards starting now jump into halloween themed maps games and experiences made by the community during the fort nightmares call out these will be featured in the fort nightmares section of the playlist menu fort nightmares 2021 has many new and returning halloween outfits in store some of what to expect throughout the month cards will reveal legendary monsters making their way to the fortnite item shop as well as classic fortnite characters getting new halloween twists with each item shop debut a card will flip over in this evolving page so this is pretty cool i'll leave a link to this by the way in the description take a look at the card to see who's entering the item shop and see the backs of the cards for hints at who's next so that's actually the other news post here and we'll actually read into this right now many new and returning outfits are in store for fort nightmares 2021 including storied monsters making their fortnite debut classic fortnite characters with new halloween twists are creeping in also keep checking back to find out these new and returning Halloween outfits haunting the item shop this October. A fortune card will flip over with each arrival, while the backs of the remaining cards will hint at who's next. So for week one, which is today until the 11th, here's what they say. Four cards are in the cards for week one. As you can see, the card for Frankenstein's monster is already flipped over. Frankenstein's monster, which includes the vintage Frank alt style, will be available in the item shop on October 5th at 8 p.m. So tonight, we're literally getting Frankenstein's monster tonight, and that is really cool. That, that's really neat. They also mentioned here there's no pattern as to when the rest will flip over, but try using the hints to sew what they'll reveal. So the first card here obviously is Frankenstein. We are getting this tonight, which is awesome. And then we have three cards here for just this week. This is just this week for the item shop. Now I can just kind of guess here. I think we're going to get Frankenstein tonight as they confirmed that already. So obviously I know that's going to happen. So that's a Tuesday. Then on Thursday, we'll probably get the Curdle Scream Leader. And then on Saturday, we'll probably get the new Renegade Raider skin, which is called the Skeletara skin. So we already know about that skin. And then the final one here, which I think would come out on Monday, it looks like that is going to be a Walking Dead collab. That's my guess. I mean, I would love a Walking Dead collab. I thoroughly enjoyed the first season of the show. I think the first season was amazing. Then the second season was, it was pretty weird. I don't understand like a lot of the characters' motives. Regardless of that, that looks like Rick's hat. So if we actually get rick in the game that would be really cool and 
Again, Fortnite is so in deep with these collaborations that they've been doing, it would make sense for them to give us collabs this Halloween. I mean, Frankenstein, I would consider that a collab, right? I mean, is Frankenstein like free public use? Because something tells me it might not be. So I think this is legit going to be a collab, which I'm totally fine with. If you're going to keep doing collabs, you might as well do some really cool ones for Halloween. And I think that's what they're doing here. So I do fully believe that is Rick Grimes from Walking Dead, mainly because obviously the cowboy hat. But I did notice a hint in the cards that kind of made me laugh a little bit. I'm still kind of giggling about it. You could see in the picture there is a shovel. And I believe in the first episode, he gets thwacked with a shovel. So I think that's what this is going to be. And that is really cool. Excited to see what happens with that. And there's even more that they mention here, but they say here, iconic creatures, including the Universal Pictures inspired Frankenstein's monster and the mummy part of the Universal monster set. So it's Universal. That's the collab is with Universal. I, I think that's totally fine. And we're also getting the mummy, which that's awesome too. They say keep up with the card flip page and our social channels to see when they storm into the item shop. And they say here the mummy will also be lurking on the island as a character later in the month trying to find his way home into the underworld. Okay. They say to help kick things off the community inspired boxy and boxer are in the item shop now on October 5th with new glowing versions of their alternative spectral styles. So again, huge shout out to Sharktooth there. Uh, they also mentioned here throughout October, you can also visit the Battle Boss and Fortnite cosplay characters at Universal City Walk, adjacent to Universal Studios Hollywood. Different characters will appear throughout the month with special appearances by new Fortnite Mares characters the day they go live in the item shop. Stop by and take a picture. I hope someone films that because I definitely want to see that i'm obviously nowhere near that i'm not in hollywood at all but i would love to see what they actually do there one thing i do remember seeing is that there was like a battle boss i think it was actually at universal as well so i think that's what they were using it for pretty cool stuff they say the cubes are mobilizing for the next step of their plan later in the month they'll escalate their domination of the island strengthen your resolve with a new weapon from the sideways and returning halloween tricks a special LTM will be returning as well. During the cube chaos, there will also be quests to accomplish for eerie rewards. Speaking of Halloween tricks, the new dual fiend hunters are now on the island. We already talked about that, but still pretty cool. They also say Four Nightmares 2021 will be wrapping up with the third short night film festival. My God, did I love the second one? The first one was good too, but Gilded Guy and the second short night was absolutely fantastic. Can't wait to see what they do with this again. They said like previous short nights, short nightmares will feature animated shorts, but this time the shorts will be based on the ghoulish and sinister. Also, the short night will take place in a creator made movie theater created by Quantum Builds. Yo, congratulations to all of them over there. That's awesome. Where each short will have its own theater room. Choose the order you watch them in or watch them all in a loop in the festival room. We'll share more details on short nightmares closer to the show. Consider this your invite card. I'm sold. I'm so excited for that. That is awesome. Again, huge shout out to Quantum Builds for making that. That's awesome. Now, the final thing here they say is what we announced here isn't even everything happening in Fort Nightmares this year. Stay tuned during the month for what other festivities are in your future. And then they have this image here. This is the week one one, which I don't know what this really entails here. This just looks like that creepy cuddle team leader doll that we had in creative. I don't know if that necessarily means anything. Week two, we have a golden skull trooper. That is interesting. Is this an edit style? Is this a new skin? Is this saying that all the previous edit styles for Skull Trooper will be made available to everyone now? I don't necessarily know, but that is interesting. A Golden Skull Trooper. If I had to guess, it's probably just an edit style, but yeah that that's interesting that that's that's just interesting i mean i see no blue eye glow so i'm hyped for it week three we do get the secret skin from this season and then week four is the short nightmares very excited for all this happening and guys that's really it for the video i'm super hyped for four nightmares man I was just saying yesterday that I was not feeling this season, but Fortnite Mares is definitely going to make this season a little bit more fun. At least I feel like it will. So that is it for the video today, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, 
did, please let me know with a like and subscribe to the channel if you're brand new. And if you like to use me for supporter creator, my code is ITF. You all have yourselves a wonderful day or night, everyone. See ya.